Hi, in this video we are going to talk about bit and byte manipulations that you can do in C++. Uh, you, can, uh, you can do these manipulations by selecting a, an alignment, creating a union, uh, specifying bit, bit field, by casting, by using bitwise operators, and you can check for big or little NDNS of the machine. So let's say you have a structure like this that, contain that contains one integer and two charts. Uh, the compiler will automatically put padding uh, to align to, to, let's say, for example, four bytes. But you can get rid of this padding if you use a pragma pack uh, dir directive. First, you can say uh, pragma pack push so that the compiler remembers uh, what alignment it is using currently. Then you say pragma pack 1, which means align to one byte, uh, which, mea which means uh, eliminate, the eliminate all padding. And then when you're done, you can say pragma pack pop to, to tell the compiler to use uh, the default alignment. Next, you can use union. Uh, we have this here, uh, union uh, low high. Uh, inside this union, we have a long long 64-bit uh, integer, int long. We have an unnamed structure that contains high and low, and the instantiation of that structure part. In memory, that, in, uh, that uh, union will look like this will have a l long integer that shares memory with uh, integers high and integers low. So you can access the high par portion or low portion of the long I integer long. Next you can use bit fields. Uh, if, you use if you declare a structure and then you use this column notation, uh, the number here represents the size in bits of the uh, member here. So we have here four, uh, four members of size 1 bit and one member of size 4 bits. So in memory it looks like this. Another thing you can do to manipulate bytes is to use casting. Let's say we have this long integer. We can uh, access uh, individual bytes of this long integer uh, if, we d if we do this. Take an address of the long integer, uh, cast it to char uh, array, and then dereference it uh, by indexing. And uh, this way we can access any any byte of the long integer variable. Another way to do bit manipulation is to use bitwise operators. We have a bitwise AND operator, bitwise OR operator, bitwise uh, NOT operator, bitwise e um, exclusive OR operator, and logic logic shift. Shift to the shift to the right and shift to the left. And of course, you can check if your machine is big or little endian. Uh, you can uh, you can create the integer variable and assign a value one to it. Then access the zeroth byte. The access the first byte, and if it's equal to one, uh, your machine is little endian. If you like this video and w want to see more videos like this, please check out my Patreon page, uh, the link is in the description.